Now we discuss factoring trinomials. A trinomial, remember, is a mathematical expression with three pieces. And a lot of times these can be factored. And it's very common to run into a trinomial like this where you have a variable, in this case the variable is x, and it shows up squared, it shows up by itself or just with a number, not squared, and then you have a constant term. So you have an x squared term, an x to the one term, and an x to the zero term. Expressions like this are very common, and many of them can be factored. We saw earlier that this one factors as x plus 3 times x plus 5. And we see that when we do a FOIL here, we get an x squared for the first. The outer gives us a 5x, and the inner gives us a 3x. And that 5x and 3x add up to our 8x. And then the last terms, the, the 3 times 5, gives us the 15. And notice how this works. These two numbers, the 3 and the 5, show up there and add up to 8. And then they end up, in the last part, getting multiplied. They multiply to give us the 15. So this expression factors as x plus 3x plus 5 because the 3 and the 5 add up to 8 and multiply to give me 15. And with that idea in mind, we'll look at some examples.